Hello, hello! It's a Speak Now One, Lesson 6, Part A, Workbook, Vocabulary Exercises about Interests. Well, 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 we have our interests on lots of different things. And we had this lesson in the student's book. We had asking about favorites, returning questions, and the topics we talked about were sports, video games, food, music, movies, books, traveling, and shopping. Well, I like all these things. I just don't travel as much as I wanted. Eu não viajo tanto quanto eu gostaria. And I don't play video games as much as I wanted. Eu também não jogo videogame tanto que eu gostaria. But we have these exercises here about ranking these interests from one most interesting for you to eight not at all interesting to you. Ou seja, a gente vai dizer quais que a gente gosta mais desses interesses most interesting for you. Vai ser número um. Cara, isso daqui é o meu número um de interesse. To eight, not at all interesting to you. Mas não quer dizer que você vai usar o número oito, porque se você não tem nada que você realmente não tenha nenhum interesse, você vai colocar seis, cinco, de acordo com o interesse baixo. Agora, se realmente você nunca assiste filme, ah, odeia gastar tempo com filme, raro, hein? Aí você vai colocar número 8, all right? Then write three words about that interest. Então, três palavras relacionadas, like movies, for example. They are like number three for me, here in this rank of interests. And we have actor, actress, Emma Watson, a very important actress. Sports. Mm. I think that sports are number one for me. And I have some words connected to sports. I can say, let's see, soccer, heat, that is high intensity interval training. And I also can say formula. One. Three words connected to that. Food. Mm, I can't say that it is number three. It is also number one, I would say. So let me write here number one of interest. And I would say that I love salads, proteins. and carbo, carbohydrate, food. But of course, lots of people are going to say mm, barbecue and these things. I understand pizza, hamburger, no problem. Video games. I like video games, but I never play video games. So I'm going to put number six. And racing. Uh, let's see, time consumption, consumo de tempo. Uh, you have to agree that spending time with video game is spending time that could be for other things. Você vai concordar comigo. Gastar tempo com video game é gastar tempo que você podia estar fazendo outra coisa, right? So, because of this, I put time consumption. And what else? Video games. Online. I think that online video game is something really interesting. Because you can play with your friends. So, não vai, não vai necessariamente ser uma coisa vaga. Vai ser algo muito interessante. Music. Number two. I love music, and I would say 
that I'm interested in pop, in rock, and classical. Books. Mm, books are something that I'm really interested. I like books very much, so I'm going to put number two here. And I'm going to say that the Bible is very important in my life. Oops. English books and readers. Readers are books um, for studying English. Readers são livros de histórias, só que simplificados. São bem legais. Vou ver se eu indico alguns para você, aluno, porque é algo bem interessante. Shopping for. I'm not very into shopping, but when I talk about shopping, I like trainers, sports clothes. and nutrition these are things that i'm interested traveling mm, i like traveling but i don't travel much so i could say that it is number three as well because I don't do that very frequently. Let me see travel. Beach. Praia. Plane. Flying. Flights. It's nice traveling by plane. Flights and Let me see. Vacation. É bom viajar nas férias. These are some words connected to traveling. Number two, part two. Use your ideas from part one and other ideas to complete the conversation. Oh, já pensou uma conversa dessa na sala de aula depois? Ou então gravando e mandando no grupo dos alunos? In class, get into groups of three and practice it. What's your favorite movie? My favorite movie is... Um, a favorite movie, a recent favorite movie. I don't remember a recent favorite movie, so I'm going to put an old one. My favorite movie is Dreams. Sonhos, de Akira Kurosawa. Very nice film. Let me write 16, a little smaller word now. I, I like Pretty Woman. Não tem uns filmezinhos mais novos, não, Shinky? How about actors and actress? Who's your favorite actress? My favorite actress is Deixa eu ver se eu acerto o nome aqui. Reed Witherspoon. My favorite actress is Reed Witherspoon. É assim que fala. Or Witherspoon. I think it's Witherspoon. Really? My favorite is Gloria. Hmm? No. Is Fernanda Montenegro. Right? Fernanda Montenegro is a very good actress. She is, indeed. I like Fernanda Torres as well. 
her daughter, Philadelphia. And what about music? What's your favorite song? Oh, my favorite song is And You and I from Yes. My favorite song is And You and I from Yes. Do grupo Yes. So, you like progressive rock, don't you? Remember the question tag? Você gosta, não gosta? So, you like it, don't you? Essa aqui é a ideia, ok? Yes, I do. I love it. Well, what about video games? Do you like any games in particular? Olha, to be honest, I don't. Unfortunately, I don't play video games at the moment. Isso é a minha resposta, ok? Your answer could be something like my favorite is Fortnite. Então, let's write your answer, imagine. Your answer could be... Do you like any games in particular? I... like... Fortnite... very much. Right? So, this is a dialogue. And this is for you to give your own answers. Então, você vai ter a página. Complete, com, complete por favor, a página. Esse exercício aqui me manda pelo, pelo WhatsApp, pelo, pela mensagem, com as suas respostas. Porque essas daqui seriam as minhas, para um diálogo. E quem sabe a gente pode fazer isso aqui numa chamada de áudio ou de vídeo. Hã? Oh, show, hein? So this was the exercise. I hope you liked and we see each other in the live lesson. See you later in the live lesson. Bye bye.